Hello, this is Tori with Landio. We have a 2.12 acre lot in Wyoming with road and creek frontage near the Medicine Bow National Forest. This is an actual view from the property looking west at Elk Mountain. You can see the beautiful wildflowers in bloom in the foreground. The property is practically covered in wildflowers, and these photos were taken in the last couple weeks. This is Mill Creek that runs along the northern boundary of the property. You have roughly 226 feet of frontage along Mill Creek. It's a live water creek. A photographer was out here in November of 2019, and at that point there was also live water in the creek. This is a satellite image of the parcel highlighted in green. It's 2.12 acres. There you have the creek frontage along the north boundary, roughly 226 feet of frontage along Mill Creek. And then along the southern boundary, you have roughly 205 feet of road frontage along Mill Creek Trail. And Mill Creek Trail connects directly to County Road 404, which is also known as Pass Creek Road. The distance from the county road to the property is only three-tenths of a mile, roughly 1,600 feet. This is County Road 404 leading to the property and then this is the intersection of County Road 404 and Mill Creek Trail. This is Mill Creek Trail. There's a little makeshift cattle control gate. You just move that to the side and the property is only three tenths of a mile from this intersection. This is Mill Creek Trail. You can see the path there with the spring vegetation and wildflowers. This is the plat map with the parcel highlighted in green. There you can see Mill Creek along the north boundary and there's Mill Creek Trail along the southern boundary. If we zoom in you can see there's the easement for Mill Creek Trail. All of the properties to the north and south of Mill Creek Trail use this same road to access the properties. This is the plat map with the parcel highlighted in red. You can see the blue line. There's Mill Creek. That pink dash line that also indicates the road, Mill Creek Trail. You can also see there's some contour to the property. The southern portion's at a higher elevation. And looking at the contour map, you can see that as well. The elevation's around 7,520 feet. If we go to the interactive map and turn on the topographic layer, I want to show you where this water comes from in Mill Creek. We're going to look to the west, and this creek, you follow this blue line, and it extends all the way up to the top of Elk Mountain. You can see the peak elevation here is 11,156 feet, and just south of that is where Mill Creek originates. Turn on the satellite layer again, and then follow this Mill Creek. You can see that many people around here have built close to the creek. You also have this elevated knoll right here that overlooks the creek, and Mill Creek continues on goes under County Road 404, continues heading to the northeast, continues north. Here's another home along the creek. Then it starts to turn to the east. Right here is Interstate 80. And at this point, it feeds into the Medicine Bow River, right as the Medicine Bow River goes under Interstate 80. And the Medicine Bow River actually flows through the town of Elk Mountain, named appropriately after Elk Mountain. The town of Elk Mountain is only 5.7 miles from the property, has a population of around 200. There's a post office, general store, a public library, rental cabins, a historic hotel, an RV park, and a small community church. Interstate 80 is only 8.1 miles from the property. From Interstate 80, you take exit 255, which takes you to Highway 72. Turn south on 72, that'll take you to Elk Mountain and the property. And then turn north, that will take you to Hanna, Wyoming. Hanna is about 30 minutes from the property. Almost that entire drive is on State Highway 72. Has a population around 800. In Hanna, you can find groceries, supplies, and hardware. There's also a convenience store and gas station at the intersection of Highway 72 and Interstate 80. This is a Google Earth terrain view. Here we are south of the property looking north. There's the frontage along Mill Creek Trail. There's the frontage to the north on Mill Creek. There's County Road 404. Now we're east of the property looking west. There's Elk Mountain. There are electricity lines and poles west of the property. They're about four tenths of a mile from the property. In this image, you can see the contour of the land with a higher elevation point on the south. Here are a couple photos showing you that change in elevation. This is standing on the property looking to the northeast. There you can see that change in elevation. And this is standing on the property at the higher elevation point looking to the west. And you can see that change in elevation right there as it slopes down towards the creek. Now we're west of the property looking east. There's County Road 404. You can see how that connects directly to Mill Creek Trail and to the southern boundary of the property. This is north of the property looking south. And here you have the Medicine Bow Peak with an elevation of over 12,000 feet. From the property, you're about 20 miles from the north portion of the Medicine Bow National Forest and the Bow River Campground. In this image, the property is right here. And then if you look to the south, all of this green shaded area, this is the Medicine Bow National Forest. All of this green shaded area is the Medicine Bow National Forest, contains over 1 million acres of public land, extends all the way into Colorado. There are multiple lakes in the Medicine Bow National Forest, including Lake Marie and Lewis Lake. It's popular for hunting, including elk, mule deer, mountain lion, bighorn sheep, and pronghorn antelope. 
This area is considered to be the pronghorn capital of the United States. There are pronghorn antelope all over the place. While we're on the subject of national parks and national forests, the town of Elk Mountain is a popular stopping point for people traveling to the Grand Teton National Park and Yellowstone National Park. The Grand Teton National Park is about five hours from the property, and Yellowstone National Park is about five hours and 40 minutes from the property. Regarding larger cities, we have Rollins, Wyoming, a little under an hour from the property. Rollins has a population around 10,000. This is Main Street in downtown Rollins. There's also a Walmart Supercenter, a hospital, professional services, supplies. Almost that entire drive to Rollins is along Interstate 80, and that's to the west. And then to the east along Interstate 80, Laramie, Wyoming is just a little over an hour. Laramie has a population over 30,000. There's a Walmart Supercenter, regional airport, big box stores, grocery stores, so pretty much anything you need you can find there in Laramie. Cheyenne is the largest city in Wyoming, just under two hours from the property. Cheyenne has a population over 90,000. Here's downtown Cheyenne, Main Street, near about three hours and 15 minutes from Denver, Colorado. Denver and the surrounding metropolitan area have a population over a million. There's also an international airport in Denver. There are many nearby landowners that have developed their properties to varying degrees. There is no minimum dwelling size. You can do a site-built home, shipping container home, mobile home, manufactured home, one of those tiny kit cabins, an earth ship, geodesic dome, an arch cabin. You have a lot of freedom and flexibility regarding the size and the type. We have sold a lot of property in Wyoming and it is very rare to find a property that actually borders any type of live water. It's a rare, unique, and desirable attribute. And then you also have the benefit of being so close to that county road, which provides easy access. We have this 2.21 acres in Wyoming with creek frontage and mountain views priced at $39,997. All the property details are listed here on our website. The property taxes are about $193 a year. There's no HOA or HOA fees. You'll find additional detailed information within the property description. Again, there's no minimum square footage requirement if you're to build on the property, which makes it ideal for even the tiniest of homes. We have the distances to nearby points of interest along with links where you can find more information about those locations. Here are the GPS coordinates and links where you can open those on a Google map. We have over 150 images of the property in the surrounding area. All of these images have captions. Many of them have labels. If the property is of interest, we highly recommend you take the time to look through all these images. They'll answer many questions that you have and even some you had not thought of. And at the bottom of the page, we have this interactive map. At Landio, we work extremely hard to make it super easy for you to purchase land. All you need to do is go to our website, landio.com, navigate to the property details page. There you're going to see a green buy now button. If that buy now button is green and says buy now, that means the property is available as of that moment. We only have one of each property available and we sell our properties on a first come first serve basis. To secure the property, just press that green buy now button. That's going to add a deposit of $499 to your cart, then click checkout. Once you click check out this window appears, you enter your contact information, click continue to payment, enter your payment information, and then complete the checkout process. As soon as the checkout process has been completed, this buy now button will automatically turn gray and say out of stock. If you're looking at this property and it says under contract and that buy now button is gray and says out of stock, that means that somebody has placed a deposit but have not yet completed the purchase. During that period of time, you may place a backup deposit on the property. Please contact us and we'll walk you through the steps. The backup deposit secures your place in line. If the current buyer was unable to complete the purchase, you would then by default become the new buyer. And that $4.99 backup deposit would be credited towards your purchase. If the current buyer were to complete the purchase, then that backup deposit will be refunded to you 100%. If you have any questions, our phone numbers are on the top of every page of our website. That number is 8668 Landio. That's 866 852 6346. That number also receives text messages. We have a live chat feature here on our website where you can communicate with us in real time. If we're not available for whatever reason, please send us a message to respond to our next availability. You can also fill out this contact form here on our website or send us an email directly. Our email address is hello at landio.com. If you're watching this video and you or someone that you know has property that you'd like to sell anywhere in the United States, please contact us. We've added a new section here to our website called Sell. Just go to that Sell tab. There's going to be a contact form. Just put your name, email address, phone number, and a brief message. If you have the state, county, and parcel number, that would be helpful, but it's not necessary. We're adept at researching properties and finding out that information. If you'd like to call us, you can do so at the same number, 866-8LANDIO, 866-852-6346. Again, that number does receive text messages. As always, we sincerely appreciate you taking the time to watch our property videos and ask that you please support us by sharing our website, our properties, and our videos with everyone that you know. The more people that we reach, the more dreams of land ownership we can make come true. Thank you, and may God continue to bless you and your family. Landio. Land is opportunity. 
please click in the upper left hand corner and subscribe to our YouTube channel. In the upper right hand corner we have all of our available properties in a playlist. In the lower right hand corner we have a playlist of our Land is Opportunity series. And in the lower left hand corner we have our Landio Unscripted series.